Hey guys, welcome back, welcome back to our channel. In case if you are new to this channel, please subscribe to our channel. But now in this video, I am going to share you how to connect dual display on the Windows 11 PC. So for this, you need a second display and as well as a HDMI cable. You have to connect the second display with the graphics card through the HDMI cable. So that is the first thing. So after connected, you can able to see the same desktop wallpaper in both the display. And after that, in your main uh, monitor, you can just go to the settings option of the Windows 11 PC and there go to the display section so once you connected you can able to see the option like this so dual display option so now this is the first monitor and this is the second monitor now in case if you want to make any one of the monitor as a main display so you have to enable this option make this uh, as a main display so first for that you have to select a particular display in case if you want this display as a main display means so just select the second display and uh, check mark this option make this as a main display and as you see in that now that you can able to see the taskbar in this uh, monitor also in the display section you can able to see lot this option like uh, you can duplicate both the display so once you click on the duplicate this display you can able to see the same display on uh, both the monitor itself and the next thing is that uh, you can uh, extend the display and you can only show only on one display so if you uh, click on that so only one display will be shown and the second display will be turned off so like that you can able to uh, make some other changes so every time you want to make a main display means so you have to click that display and you can uh, able to click this option make this as the main display so that you can able to do other tasks on that particular display and here you can able to see the option ease cursor movement between display so once this option enabled means you can easily able to use the same mouse for both the displays so while i'm actually dragging to the right side so i can able to see the mouse in this monitor and while i'm actually dragging the mouse to the left side I can able to use the same mouse on this display also. Now in case if you want to categorize any one of the work in the particular display means so for that we have to so in case if I want to make some of the work in the for example I want to work only in the Google Chrome browser on this display like that means so you have to select the second display and uh, click on this multiple display and, and check mark this option. Uh, make this as a main display now you can able to access all the things in the second display here you can just to open the google chrome browser and that's it now the browser has been opened up now in the main display again just to click on the first display and uh, again check mark this option make this as a main display so now as you see here you can able to do all the things in this pc so it is your main pc you can able to do all the things in this pc and in the second monitor and second display you can able to access the browser so all other things you can able to access in case of what are all the work you are actually having in the google chrome browser so all the things you can done using this monitor this second display and apart from that all other things you can able to do in this uh, main display and to use the both the device you can use the same mouse and same keyboard itself so this is the first display and this is the second display by just uh, hovering the mouse to the right side of the first display you can able to see the same mouse in the second display and by just uh, hovering the mouse to the left side of the second monitor you can use the same mouse on the first monitor as well as uh, and also you can able to use the keyboard also so you can use the same keyboard for the both the display as well as uh. and the one more thing is that so what application you are actually opening on that particular display so that application will actually open up on that display only for example if i actually so click on the google chrome browser so that particular application only opens on the second monitor only and apart from that if i am actually clicking on any other application means so that particular application will only open up on this monitor only even if i am actually accessing that particular application on this display also that particular application will only opens up on this display only well now that's it on this video guys and hopefully if you guys like this video hit the like button and if you are new to this channel please subscribe to our channel below and thanks for watching this video guys